Hello and welcome. Today I want to talk to you about the satellite 480 Generation 4 and the use of the swing weights. So why do we have weights? Well on any grind, in any grinding process sometimes we need to add weight to the head uh, to get the most out of the machine. Sometimes we need to have it neutral over the wheels or sometimes we need to take weight off the head depending on what we're doing, maybe even polishing. Uh, so in some situations the grinding process can take more from the machine you need to take weight off the head. Uh, so we've designed the satellite 480, the generation 4, with a fixed swing weight. So one of the disadvantages of the old generation 3 was if the weights were in the rear position and you tried to fold the machine, uh, they got in the way. So we fixed that by using the swing weights, also prevents them from being lost of course on site. So to put the weight into different positions, it's very simple. We have a handle here and a pin lock here. So pull the pin lock out and you can pull the weight forward and the weight sits there in that position. So obviously we're adding uh, weight to the head in this position. You can do both sides of course. It's exactly the same both sides. And uh, obviously in this weight position here, um, it's adding weight to the head and obviously we can increase the load on the machine. Now if you find the machine's running over 100% on the digital display, you may need to remove weight off the head. So the first thing to do is to put the weight directly over the wheels into that position there. That's a neutral position. Uh, have a go with that. And if it's still over 100% regularly, you may need to take weight off the head. So you can move one weight or both to the rear position. And to do that, obviously pull the pin out, slide the weight down to the back. And obviously in this position, being behind the wheels, it's taking weight off the head of the machine. Very simple. You can obviously do one side or both depending on how much load you need to take off the head. Um, it won't affect the grinding process if you have just one back. So obviously when you tilt the machine backwards um, and this weight is in this position, the weight will just rest on the floor, um, but it will come up out of the way while you're doing the work under the head. And then you can move it back down uh, once you've got the machine back into the grinding position. So generally when you're using the weights in this machine, We'd always start with the weights over top of the wheel. It's a good neutral um, position. If you need to add weight to the head, put it this side, weight off the head uh, at the back. So thanks for watching and we'll see you again.